I don't even want this video to be mad long, so I'm kind of just gonna get into it. I'm just being honest with y'all, I'm just getting into it. Sorry, but we just get into it. But, um, so I gotta do the intro, I got to. Okay, so I look silly right now, but what's up, what's up, what's popping, guys? It's your girl, everything, Alex, and I'm back at it again with another YouTube video. Okay, so as y'all can see, I'm in the middle of doing my makeup. And me recording this video was really just for the moment so yeah um if you are new to this channel of what it is hey what's up what's up got your again good god and what it is what's up what's popping with you i'm happy to have you here and if you are a returning subscriber hey boy hey girl i missed you okay so um like i said i'm already in the not really in the middle but in the beginning of doing my makeup and i've really been slacking y'all so I guess I kind of just wanted to get on here and, and vibe and chill with y'all and talk about me slacking because it's not cute. It's not cute at all. Um, but yeah. Before we do get into this video, please make sure you do like, comment, and subscribe. You know all of that. Hey, all of that. Hey, hey, all of that. Hey, all of that. And make sure you do keep supporting the culture all 2020. Gang, gang, gang. Hit it for me, can you stop? Hey, I won't stop. Oh, don't fall. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, hit it, dun. Hey, hit it, dun. Hit it one more time. Dun, 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 dun. Yes, make sure you do like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you do keep supporting the culture all 2020. All right. So, yeah. Today's video is going to be a chit chat get ready with me. Because I'm already getting ready. So that's what's going on here today. And I kind of just wanted to talk about a couple things. I don't be having much to talk about because I don't really like, you know, you know. But like I said, I've really just been slacking and I don't really know what kind of makeup look I'm creating. I was making a TikTok video, so that's why I was doing my makeup. But let me think real quick. Um, like I said, I don't know what type of makeup look I'm finna do. I'm just about to do something because I'm trying to. I be having like I be having so much stuff to do, so just trying to you know. I'm using this palette I've never used before. It's called Esmeralda by Beauty Creations. I got this out of my boxy charm. So y'all remember when I tell y'all y'all need to go get boxy charm? Blat out. This is another reason. Like just go get it. So. I don't really know what I'm creating, but I just know that I'm gonna create something that I like. I don't know. I don't think I wanted to start down there. So I'm not. All right. So this is, I, I feel like this This is what I want to talk to y'all about. I really just be want to talk to y'all about me. That's it. That is it. Um, Lately, I want to say ever since like quarantine has been over I feel like I have not been in my bag the way I would like to be in my bag um I don't know if if I'm still like gonna use the excuse I'm trying to get used to you know not having so much time but let's be real get over it girl like get over it let me tell y'all this when i talk to myself i like to talk to myself like i'm i'm very very hard on myself so i don't do pity party i don't pity party myself i just be honest with myself like alex you gotta stop making excuses alex you gotta do what you gotta do you feel me i don't do pity parties i don't like that like i, I like to just be you know real and open about whatever the situation is and it's like, yeah, on one end of the spectrum, I guess I could be like, oh, yeah, Alex, you don't have the same amount of time because now you're working. But who isn't, you know? Don't make excuses for yourself. Do not make excuses for yourself because that is how, that's how you fail, honestly. That's how you fail.
yeah, I definitely had to make sure that this freestyle is going in the direction that I wanted. So look at it. This is the direction that I was going for. It's really cute, okay? Ooh. I don't really know why I left off about me talking, but I'm sure it was about me. But yeah, I'm like super hard on myself because I feel like that's the only way you can succeed. Like, you know, you can't, ex like you can't suspect, suspect? Not suspect. You can't expect to be successful and side note, I feel like everybody got a different, um, everyone has a, a, a different perspective on what success is to them so success to me may not be what success is to you you feel me all you may need is a dog and a mule and you're to you that's very successful but you know you know what i'm saying but like i'm just very hard on myself and that can be good and bad because like when you're super hard on yourself and like like it's good because it keeps you like motivated. It keeps you wanting to do better because you know you can. But then sometimes it kind of turns into depression, like slight depression. Or I, I want to say slight sadness because I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't like using terms that aren't like 100% true. You feel me? Because just because you're sad does not mean you're depressed. You feel me? And just cause you're, you do you know what I'm saying? So like, it's like, I, I wanna say like a category one of depression. Sorry, makeup really takes concentration for me. Yeah, I feel me. But yeah, like one thing that I'm, really sucking at right now is my lack of time management i have no sense of time management whatsoever <laughs> oh why are you laughing like that you do not laugh like that but yeah lately i've been really feeling like i don't have a sense of time management like i'm not doing what I need to do when I need to do it and that don't sit right with me it may sit right with you it don't sit right with me I don't really know how on God's green earth I'm going to finish recording this TikTok of my makeup and record a get ready with me at the same time but we can make it do what it do if you're not following me on TikTok you definitely should like where is it you definitely should follow me on tiktok i dance that's what i really do on tiktok i dance because i love to dance or i'm doing my makeup mm. y'all this tiktok i'm making fire all right so i don't know i'm gonna be wanting to spend all day on my makeup Ugh. My nigga, cut the chair, cut the chair, turn it down. Hey, turn your goofy down. Pow. That's the song I did to my TikTok. Y'all, it's just really something about Nicki Minaj. It's like every time I do my makeup to a Nicki Minaj song, it's kind of like, girl, girl, girl. Like it brings out a whole new side of me. A whole new hair. You feel me? All right, y'all. Oh, this is my hairstyle I did. Lately, I've been doing my own hair because let me let me tell y'all. Let me tell y'all about these hairstylists. Some of you, some of them, I'm trying to understand. Ooh, I don't know what's on my head, but it hurt. But here's what I'm trying to understand. I want to understand how these prices 
how do y'all curate prices? That's what I want to know. Yeah, like me and my friends are curious. How y'all come up with y'all prices? Cause I don't be understanding. Now with like day and age with the, um, you know, social media, videos, tutorials, all of these hairstyles we could really do with myself. And I know like hairstylists will always, y'all always have clientele because, um, because it's just number one is some hairstyles that you want. So sometimes you want a professional, okay? Most times you want a professional. So like for instance, when I get married, I don't know if, will I do my own makeup? Probably not. I'm gonna try my best not to, you feel me? But like, that's a, an instance. I'm gonna pay somebody to do my hair. Um, but sometimes y'all just be doing too much. Sometimes I'm like, like these butterfly locks I did in my head. They did not take me long. The only reason why they did is because it was my first time doing them. I didn't know what I was doing. And I'm like a perfectionist. So, no, they're not the best. But for my first time, baby, I did pretty darn good. Stop playing with me. But like these butterfly locks, people charge an arm and a leg for them. And I'm trying to understand why when they're so easy to do. And I really want to try them. Like, I want to do them on someone else's head just so I can get better at them. But they're literally so easy. And like I just said, you could literally do them for yourself. But meanwhile, let a stylist, and the reason why I'm not paying a stylist to do this is because it's just like, like I just said, they're going to dare finna charge me an arm and a leg. But they gonna charge me a mortgage just to crochet some hair in my head that don't take long. Like, I just want to know how other how y'all come up with y'all prices. How y'all be like, oh, that's what we finna charge. And I'm not talking about you hairstylists that actually deserve it, but like stuff like it's certain hairstyles that I just think is y'all be waxing for. Now I'll pay for I'll pay for a good so when I I will so this is random but excuse my language females you do not have to be fine with whole culture okay like I feel like nowadays we live in a time and era where everybody's just like it's her body she do what she want yada 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 like I mean at the end of the day if you like it I love it but. We do not have to be fine with whole culture. We do not have to be fine with being a whole and that's just, you know, we're gonna act like we're getting it out of the mud cause we're being a whole, like no. I feel like people have really been camouflaging their ass. Oh, y'all don't say nothing when the men do it. Shut up, worry about yourself. And I know y'all probably thinking, oh, you need to worry about yourself. No, I'm in your business. Hmm. And I'm gonna stay in it. And I know some of y'all may get mad, but I'm just not here for it. Like, I'm not here for you sucking and, you know, fucking your way to the top. I'm not here for that. That's not cute. Neither am I in the same spectrum. Neither am I, you know, trying to act like if you're not doing that, you're better than the next. But I just feel like there's a level of respect we should be wanting for ourselves. That's what I'm trying to say. Y'all... Okay, so let me kind of backtrack. So when I'm talking about like whole culture, I'm kind of talking about like the self-respect that women like to have for themselves. And I know some of them don't care, but can we start? Can we care? That's, that's all I want. All I want is for women to like actually care about themselves because that's the only way for other people to care about us. If we don't care about us, Nobody ain't gonna care about us. Y'all, I'm really just gonna get back on my grind. I promise. Like I am. I am. You know what don't sit right with me? It really don't sit right with me that you have to eat healthy to lose weight. Like, I don't like that. How, how am I gonna do that? How am I gonna do that? If you want to actually like lose weight and lose it effectively and for 
like you know for for a long let me for a long time yeah if you want the weight to actually like stay off you have to eat healthy and i don't like that like i don't it just seems impossible you tell me why should i have to deprive myself and starve myself of what i really want just for a body just to have a figure like no i don't like that and i think it's really unfair I mean, I guess I could do surgery, but I ain't got the money for that. I was, what I was doing? Y'all, I've been really loving like a orange blush. Cause if you're a melanin girl, orange blush is for you, okay? Don't be alarmed. <laughs> I just feel like it screams warmth and I don't really have an orange blush so I use an orange um, eyeshadow. I like how it looks. You ain't gotta like how it looks, but I do. Um, but I seen this video, this video where and it really spoke to me what the girl was basically talking about some, you don't need motivation, you need discipline and I was like, <sighs> Don't come for me like that. Don't come for me like that. I'm gonna see if I can put the video in here so y'all can see what I'm talking about. All right, now I kind of went a little too ham with the orange highlighter. <laughs> Nothing that you can't blend out, you feel me? Bella, like a pumpkin. Stop playing. Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, hold up. You see a baby coming through your weather. Hold up. I'm in that new meeting, new new when I roll up. Like I said, nothing you can't fix. I just kind of wear him. Alrighty, but yeah, the girl was basically talking about, you know, not needing motivation, you need discipline, discipline to get the stuff done that you said you was, you heard me, and I completely agree with that, and I feel like it really spoke to me because, like I said, I haven't been really good with, like, my time management lately, and so, like, what I did, like, my words for the month of November is discipline and consistency because that's the only way to like really see growth and to see change in whatever area aspect of your life is to have discipline and consistency so i like i like to do this thing where like i have about like i have about like one two three four four different like draw erase boards in my room and they're all for the greater good you know me Cause I'm, I'm like the type of person I have to write stuff out for it to make sense. I need to be able to look at it for it to make sense. Like I need to be able to talk it out for it to make sense. Oops, don't fall. So yeah, those were our, like discipline was already my word for the month of November. And so like on one of my boards, I have like this elaborate, drawn out plan of how every day of my life should go like like i feel like i kind of need a routine because it'll help me keep on track of doing everything i need to do because i can't do everything that i'm doing in one day if that makes sense like every single day i never get anything done so i try to like break it up on like okay this day you do this this day you do that like that this highlighter is so cute I forgot how cute it was. I really gotta give y'all like a new office tour because baby, I'm loving the setup. Like you see, I got my ring light in front of me. You clearly can't see that, but then you see me back there because I got 
a big mirror, big stunting, big shining, you feel me? Big reflection. <laughs> I feel like the only thing I really think about is being successful. That's it. So I guess I guess that's my real problem. That that's all I think about. That's it. Honestly, I'm really creeping myself out doing that. Like, stop. That's so creepy. That is so creepy. Stop. Oh my gosh. I'm about to have nightmares of myself. <laughs> mm. So I guess really the root of my problem is that I do just need to practice better self-discipline. And yes, I am a work in progress. <laughs> But, child, this look really came out, like, this really popped out. I really like the distressed butterfly locks, but the thing I don't like is they kind of start to get old really fast. And, I mean, it's kind of good and bad because since they already distressed, it doesn't really look like they messed up because that's how they're supposed to be. And this lip combo is always it for me, like... I live for like like brown liner and fill her in. I'm living for that. That's like literally my go-to lip combo. It's really my only lip combo that I even really like. Ooh. I hope I messed the edges up, but if I did, oh well, child. Don't play with who? Don't play with me. And that's on everything I love. Child, I look real cute, y'all. I look real cute. Stop playing with me. This is this is not. This is not a joke, but at the end of the day, like I said, I know I really need to work on my time management and we'll, we'll work on that. We'll continuously work on that. We'll get back to, you know, quarantine vibes where I was like complete and, and collecting. You yeah, feel me? Um, but yeah, I hope you guys really like this video. Um, if you guys got any tips, tricks, or, you know, comments, leave that in the comment section below. Um, if you guys got any color combos that you would like me to do for my makeup, because I'm kind of running out of ideas sometimes, y'all can leave that below too. Um, if you have not already, please make sure you do like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you do keep supporting the culture all 2020. Gang, gang, gang. <laughs> we out. <laughs> oh my gosh, I look so pretty. So which in the position for you? <laughs> I'm gonna put this one on this side too because she get on my nerves. But it don't look right.